everybody and welcome back to Pure Power Panda. Today I'm going to show you how you can easily create a no makeup makeup look. This means I'm going to apply makeup just to give myself a fresher and cleaner look without actually looking like I'm wearing makeup. This is a great look if you're just starting out to wear makeup, if you don't want to look like you're wearing makeup, if you in general don't really apply a lot of makeup and this also works as a great look for school. So I'm starting off by applying a little bit of concealer to to my dark circles and to any blemishes and spots from any pimples. I definitely recommend picking out a concealer that really matches your skin color. I'm blending everything with a moist beauty blender. Once everything is blended in and you cannot see any lines, I'm applying a little bit of loose mineral powder but only a tiny little bit of it. Also make sure that this one really matches your skin color. As you can see in this shot, you can't really tell that I'm applying anything to my face but once I'm done you can really see that my skin tone looks more even and more matte than before. Now with the eyebrows I recommend just going with what you have and basically only filling them in. If you have great eyebrows from the start I wouldn't do anything to them but mine are just very light so I'm filling them in with tiny strokes and then I'm going through that with a brush. There's not a product on that brush I just use it to kind of smoothen out the lines I did earlier and finally I'm just applying a little bit of eyebrow gel just so they stay nice in place. Now to make my eyes pop without having to apply a lot of makeup I'm just taking a dark brown eyeshadow and I'm applying it right on my lash line with a very fine brush. I'm not applying a cat eye or anything because I want it to look as natural as possible. Then I'm curling my lashes. If you curl your lashes you actually don't have to use as much mascara. For the mascara I'm going very light but be sure to get it on all of your lashes even the ones on the inner corner of your eyes. I'm not applying anything to my bottom lashes because with my eyes you can tell right away if I'm wearing any makeup on the bottom lashes. Now I'm contouring my face with a light bronzer. Be sure to blend it out really well so there won't be any visible lines and if you want a more natural look I recommend bringing it upwards to the temples and the forehead. Now for blush I recommend using a cream blush because these have a more natural texture. For the color I wouldn't Go with a peach or pink color. For most people when they're out and they're sweating and running usually it's a more red undertone so that's why I picked this color and I'm also not just applying it to the apples of my cheek or my cheekbones because I want a really natural look so I'm actually applying it all over my cheek and even on the back of my nose because this just gives a more natural look. On the lips I'm just applying a little bit of lip balm and just to give everything a nicer and fresher effect I'm applying some highlighter with a brush to the outer corners of my lips and even on the bottom. This kind of looks like I'm wearing lip gloss but I'm not and it's just really nice because it reflects the light. I'm also applying that same highlighter in the inner corner of my eyes. You can't really tell in this video but that's the whole point of it. It's gonna reflect a lot of light and just make me look more fresh and awake. So this is the finished look here. You can see the before and after shot again. I think I do look a lot fresher without actually looking like I'm I'm wearing a lot of makeup. Obviously if you are a girl and you're into makeup you can probably tell that I'm wearing makeup but I'm sure most guys wouldn't be able to tell. I really hope you enjoyed this video and it had some helpful tips for you. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you in my next video. Bye bye!